What up, what up, what up? It's Matthew, the designer. Changing the culture of a company, it's not as easy. Not as easy at all. Because of the nature of human beings, who we are. We are emotional beings, we live in the body, and we have the mind. So through, through my experience, I've developed some small uh, systems and ways in which to get people to buy into what you want them to do in different ways maybe to maybe there's a cleaning system or you want to get to get the place to be as neat as possible uh, so it's not easy to do that so these are the systems that I use things that will be there as people are working they are constantly reminding them that keep clean keep clean keep clean obviously when you kickstart a cleaning process or a cleaning system to keep your work environment clean people by nature they are resistant they've got their own ideas why it's not gonna work or why we're not gonna do uh, but with time give it a month remind them uh, make these uh, these boards this notice board uh, so that you can uh, find a way to influence them or to to communicate the idea subconsciously than consciously than reminding them that you have to clean you have to clean sometimes you have to use uh, things uh, such as these to remind people to keep the environment clean i like a clean environment in in printing because um, most cases we are working with uh, vinyl something that is adhesive we are working with uh, with the machines uh, which if they catch a dust it's costly to to repair so i always uh, encourage a very very clean environment also make use of a checklist like uh, things that are gonna get the team to understand where we are going in most cases they're not gonna take the initiative but with time uh, we are human beings we will we will buy the idea so these are the systems that i'm using to make sure that i uh, do things the right way and win over uh, the team, the employees. It's a tough one, but it's, it's possible to keep the place clean.